Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my everyday makeup routine, um, hence why I have like absolutely no makeup on, and I'm going to be using my Lorac Pro palette since I did get a lot of requests to do a little bit more tutorials using the Lorac Pro palette, and um, we just gave one away to, um, the winner was Tiara, so this should be pretty helpful, um, and I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So first I'm going to prime my face and I'm going to be using um, Bare Minerals Primetime Face Primer Foundation Primer and I like this primer because it's a silicone based primer and I tend to favor these a little bit more so I just put that all over. Then I'm going to use my BB cream and today I've been trying out like all my new BB creams so I've been kind of alternating them just to kind of see which ones I like. Um, and just kind of consciously thinking throughout the day like if my face feels oily so the one I'm going to be using today is my um, physician's formula BB cream and this is in medium deep so it's um, a little darker than my typical one but I don't really care because I feel like they all kind of look the same anyway so I'm just gonna put a little bit in my expert um, face brush by Real Techniques and then I just buff this into the skin Um, and I also feel like right now I don't have anything really on my face to show you guys how well the coverage is. Um, it's definitely a light coverage, but um, the other day I had like a red like dot here. I don't know if it was like trying to be a pimple or something. I don't know. And one there. And I put this on and it, co it took the redness out. So it does cover pretty much. My BB cream is all over my face. I'm just going to go in with my concealer and I've been using my L'Oreal True Match Concealer Pencil and I really love this pencil I do. I like it. I think you guys should check it out. I just go under my eye and like a V. is so light because <laughs> that's my mascara. I got it in fair light to just kind of, it's going to tone down, calm down. Some people are going to be like, your face looks ashy, um, but it does tone down. I actually like it. Like I like having like a nice highlight on my face. So boom. Let's see. Then I just take my Real Techniques powder brush. God, I dropped something on the floor. I hate when I do that. Get it after. And um, my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in medium deep. And I just put that on my face. Under my eyes, I use my Real Techniques. And I got to look at this one because I just got it. Setting brush. And my Revlon Nearly Naked powder, Press Powder in medium. And I set my under eyes with that because it's a bit lighter. Next, I'm going to do my um, bronzer. And I'm using um, NARS and Casino, my favorite bronzer of all time. I need to get another one because obviously I'm getting there. And I'm like sad every time I open it. And then I use my NARS Albatross to highlight. And that um, brush that works best for me is my mineral brush from e.l.f. It's just like a little angled brush. I feel like I look really tan. <laughs> I'm just going to put a little bit of blush on my cheeks. And I'm going to be using Small Vanity. Um, from the Glamour Days collection by MAC and I'm going to use my Sony Kashuk blush brush for that. So of course I'm going to start out by priming my eyes with my Lorac Pro um, eye primer. Just put that all over my lids. 
and this is pretty easy because I'm really just going to use like three colors but they're real basic so I'm just going to start with putting the color cream all over my lid and pop that on and put it all over my lid to get the color mauve right there and put that in my crease. Okay, and then I'm gonna go and deepen that with the Sonia Kashuk brush with the color Sable. And I'm also just gonna put that in my crease, focus more on the outer corner. And then I'm going to finish with eyeliner, of course, and I'm going to be using my Maybelline Eye Studio in Black is Black, which I really like. Um, I still like my L'Oreal one. I don't really feel like there's that much of a difference between the two, to be honest with you, so, but I like them both. And I'm using my Sonia Kashuk um, eyeliner brush. I've seen a lot of people be, like leave comments on my mm -hmm. eyeliner posts and they're like, well, um, I can't ever get my line to go like that or whatever. And it takes a lot of practice, to be honest. I feel like I still don't even have it like down packed. Like I do one at a time to kind of see where I can like adjust sometimes. Sometimes it's just like, bam. And I'm like, what? Did I just do that? Like without even thinking about it. But other times I'm like, you know, having to overcorrect and stuff like that. Um... But I think for like my everyday, I just kind of drag it out a little bit. So. And it's done. And they're pretty much the same now. Okay. And then for under my lash line, I just kind of like to take this little um, Sonia Kashuk accent brush and it no it's not Sony Kashuk sorry real techniques and I love this little brush it's like really cool it gets like seriously every I don't know I feel like it just holds a lot of the eyeshadow and it just so nicely puts on but I like to put on my under eye line so I'll go back in with the darkest one which was sable I'm sorry my phone keeps coming out going off I should have silenced it but I did not um and I put that under my lash line Okay, so the last thing I'm going to do, well, not the complete last thing because I'm going to put some lipstick on, but um, is my mascara. And actually, like, I left my big gig SD card at Kaylee's house, so I've only been able to use my small one. So in between, like, takes I'm having to upload on my computer so I can, like, keep filming. And um, it's actually, during that time, I did kind of decide to go a little bit um, further with my eyeliner. Um, anyways, so I just wanted to show you guys that. But the mascaras I'm going to be using are, like, my absolute favorite mascaras right now. Um, and it's my Maybelline Rocket Volume. And I really love this mascara, like, even just on its own. But I think when I add, um, the Bare Minerals, it kind of just adds, like, some extra length. But this definitely volumizes my lashes. So, it's there. And I think the big brush helps with the volume.
and with these two mascaras like who needs fake lashes really and I'm just gonna finish up with my Maybelline I hope this is Maybelline oh my gosh yes <laughs> my Maybelline color whisper in lust for blush and this is one of my favorite colors and it's just like a nudie pink color that is it that is my everyday makeup just pretty basic um you know nothing like crazy no sparkly colors or anything and um if you hope you guys really like this video and if you have any more requests using the Lorac, the Lorac Quill palette i have a couple more ideas that i'm going to be filming um but you can leave them in the comment section below and i'll see you guys next time bye